This former Dollar General employee in Tampa says she was fired over her TikTok videos. She posted several videos about the challenges at her job before the company let her go. Now her videos are viral, but that's not all she wants. Nico Clemens joins us live in the Tampa newsroom with more on her story. Thank you, Keith Jennifer. Uh, Mary Gundel was a manager at the Tampa store. So one day she, she picked up her phone. She hit record and began talking about the working conditions, which she, of course, wasn't a fan of, as you just saw. Uh, she knew she was taking a risk, but she also hoped something would change. So now it's about holding Dollar General accountable. It's a decision Mary Gundel doesn't regret. And we want them to change. In March, the Dollar General store manager was frustrated. She felt unappreciated. She says there weren't enough hours for other employees, leaving her to work alone until early in the morning. And she believes working conditions were unsafe. Well, she got on TikTok and started talking Market. about the challenges. You mean to tell me that you want to give these stores so little labor to where they're literally killing themselves? No offense, but for a company that doesn't even know your name? Her videos gain momentum. What, because of my budget cuts, I'm here by myself until 2 o'clock. However, these posts cost Gundel her job. She says Dollar General fired her May 1st. In the beginning, it was just to bring awareness to our everyday customer that, you know, our stores are messy. Yes, our, our, our shelves are, are empty. Yes. Um, but it's not always the employee's fault. Gundel says since she's posted her videos, other Dollar General employees from all over the country have reached out and shared similar experiences. Dollar General said in a statement, we are committed to providing an environment where employees can grow their careers and where they feel valued and heard. We are disappointed any time an employee feels that we have not lived up to these goals. Gundel believes she made the right decision, not just for herself, but for Dollar General employees everywhere. We want their employees to actually start making a living wage and we want their buildings to be safe. Dollar General went on to say we disagree with any assertion that Ms. Gundel's termination was improper. Last month, uh, Ms. Gundel, she helped organize a rally in Tennessee with other employees to bring awareness to the shareholders who are a part of Dollar General. In the newsroom, Nico Clemens, 8 on your side.